Hello everybody. We want to look at a concept here of formulas as you're getting started in Excel. Excel is all about formulas. You enter numbers, you create formulas, it does the calculation for you. So we want to look at a, as a, at a basic worksheet I have here. Up here we have a, a worksheet, Eric's used books. We have data for first quarter, second quarter, third quarter, fourth quarter. We have formula areas right here where you would have a formula to calculate the total in the, you know, for each row it would show in this total column and for each column it would show in this total row. Now I've got two worksheets here, one, two, and they look the same. Let's look at this first one here and if you look, if I click on a particular cell like this total for used books, you see a formula equal sum B4 colon E4. Now this is not about how to create formulas, just the concept of a formula versus a non-formula. As a matter of fact, if I now hold down the, the control key and hit tilde, that's the key to the left of one and exclamation mark on your keyboard, it opens up and it shows me the formula version of the worksheet. And you can see there's a formula here for, for every um, formula in the, every formula cell in the total column and formulas for every cell in the total row. Now if I uh, go to control and tilde again, I'm back to the normal view. Now I'm going to switch to another to that other worksheet. It looks exactly the same, but watch when I do control tilde, you'll see there's not a single cell anywhere that, can, that contains a formula. Someone simply entered the values in. Now let me go back again and if I actually click on each one of these cells you'll see up here there's just a number. This is called the formula bar. It shows you what's in, in each cell and every one is a number. Let me switch back to that formulas version again and as I go down there looking at formulas you'll see sure enough there's a formula in each cell. Since Excel is all about formulas, it's not about data entry, although you've got to get the data in there upon which the formula calculates or which it uses for the calculations, it's all about the formulas. So if a person turns this in to me without a formula, let me go to the other other example here, no formulas, see, just an entry, uh, data entry number, and that's all. It tells me three things. One, the person never read the book at all. Or, two, they didn't read the instructions for the project. And or, three, I'm just trying to cheat by entering values, and I'm too lazy to do the whole thing. For whatever reason, this is going to receive, guess what grade? Zero. So please, Excel is all about the formulas. If Excel is new to you, then you need to take the time to read that chapter. And even if you think you know a lot about Excel, I'm sure there are things in there that you will find out that you didn't know already that will make your life easier. So that's it. I hope everybody has a good one. See you. Bye-bye.